What's going on, guys? It's Nock. Welcome back to stream slash episode number three of a Pipe Push Paradise. And um, in comparison to the last episode, we should be going a bit further this time. Um, apologies, like the last one was a little bit um, short. Um, we kind of like died off on Friday um, from the stream, but um, yeah, for those of you who are stuck around with the stream, um, it got interesting, we'll say that, with the worms, I'm again and stuff with Deathwish and a load of crap, but um, yeah, no, we're going to carry on pushing pipes. And we're about halfway through the puzzles, whether we're halfway through the game or not, I don't know, because um, things are probably going to be a little bit trickier. Also, let me just remember to up the audio a little bit, the sound audio. Oh, we did say before that it was a little bit quiet. Anyway, so... We got up to here. Remember this one? Just trying to get my bearings. Yeah, I think we've been going around like in a circular motion kind of, so. Alright, let's pitfall. teaching us about holes which is a, a new mechanic it looks like all right it's a little tutorial area I guess so let's try and tackle log off and I think what I'm gonna have to do here is get this on here it's being stopped there I think what I need to do is something like this. Swing it round. Oh, but then... turn this one around. So yeah, that's that bit's right up to there, at that point. But then with this bit here... I need to... I need to rotate this... Started off some good momentum today. It's always a bonus. So just looking, uh, the one directly ahead of us is actually the last one. It looks like with these rotating pieces. Um, so yeah, we've been saving the last of the clean water for drinking. Hygiene was taken the back seat. Sorry about the smell. Yeah, I think. Oh. I was just about to say, I kind of feel like... I feel like these puzzles, with the rotation pieces, have been... I've not really struggled on them, is what I'm getting at. Famous 
this last one it's a knock. So basically hmm. something like that though I've got to kind of like build it up gradually piece by piece. Also, I didn't want to push that one down there like that. Yeah, pretty much as soon as you'd gone, um, I'd pretty much sort it out. Thanks, um, thanks a lot though for for the, for the help on that one, Flame Tusk. I appreciate it. But uh, what's going on, buddy? Glad you are well. Welcome to the stream. So I've heard lots of mixed things about Final Fantasy 15. Uh, uh, no, sorry, you said 14, 15. Ignore me. Ignore me, please. So yeah, I feel like the pressure plates puzzles were really, really simple in comparison. What do you have to say, dude? Shh. Nice. <laughs> what was this called? Spout Spinner. kind of like sitting back and like chilling um yeah i just i don't know i just heard like a lot of negative things about 15. um i will actually be doing i'm actually going to be relatively soon i'll be going back to final fantasy and i'm actually going to be streaming final fantasy 8 which i have not played for a very long time and uh, I'm looking forward to doing so I was kind of umming and ahhing whether or not to do a playthrough of 8 or play 7 again because I really I'm really interested by the 
uh, the new threat mod. Uh, on Final Fantasy 7, but as I've only just finished playing 7 again and I spent a lot of time on it, I kind of think I'm going to go for the 8 route first. Yeah, 7, seven was the first one I played, and um, I've t told this story so many times, but um, I always remember I borrowed it off my cousin. Um, who lived away, and he was down for like uh, a week or something back at home. And I borrowed it off him, and I always remember going into the very first reactor. And because I was like younger, and um, I didn't really read stuff, I didn't really properly understand what it was telling me on the Guard Scorpion fight, or Grand Scorpion fight. So um, basically, for the first... However, however long it was, oh shit, I, didn't want to do that. I was just kind of like, couldn't get past the first boss because I didn't read and didn't understand what the game was actually telling me to do properly. Because it tells you to um, not to attack while his tail's up. And I, I don't know, I just didn't understand <laughs> what it was telling me to do. So yeah, I've told that story so many times. Guard Scorpion, that's it. Alright, so I don't know what I'm doing here. It's got to be this. But then how do I get this round here as well? Because, yeah, that happens. Is that now stuck in there? Yeah, that's stuck in there. Undo. that actually mm. scorpion boss 10 uh, how far was that in the game I, I've not played 10 for years See, my big problem, right, is that although I am, a, I, I really do enjoy Final Fantasy series. I had every single one from um, one through to twelve, including Ten Two and Dirge of Cerberus. Um, but I just, I have only ever completed seven. Uh, I don't think I finished ten. So yeah, I've finished 7 and 10-2 and Dirge of Cerberus. I haven't actually... I've never finished the other ones. And true, true to my word, I not so long ago, I actually took my... I t took all of my collection of Final Fantasy, well most of my Final Fantasy games actually to the dump because I had no media to play like PlayStation 1 games on and um, at the time Final Fantasy 1 and 2 was like a, a, a joint disc when I bought it, it was like a 2 in 1 kind of game, so you got them both on the same disc that was still in its original PlayStation 1 wrapper, I'd never even taken it out of the wrapper and played it I think probably the same with um uh, I think it was probably the same case with three. I 
I feel a bit bad, really. But, hey. I'll push that back again. Back on track. I did, no, I did have a PS2. But, um... I just didn't have a way to play the games once I got rid of my PlayStation 2. Yeah, I mean, uh, in, in, like, skipping back to kind of, like, modern day. Yeah, it wasn't, um, you see, I, I only actually found out the other day, if I'd have kept my PlayStation 1 games, um, you can actually play place any PlayStation 1 game on the PS3. Um, I didn't realise that. I thought that they'd just taken off all the um, backwards compatibility from the PlayStation 3 because I actually had an original PlayStation 3 and the the original suffered from an overheating issue which basically melts the solder on the motherboard and then renders the console um, obsolete. So that happened and then I had to get a replacement. And um, I, just, I was t under the impression at the time that... Um, um, all the backwards compatibility had been taken off and it wasn't on the newer consoles so I just got rid of my entire collection and I've recently found out I, literally last week I found out that all PS3s can play PS1 games and I was a little bit like damn I think I was listening to somebody talking about the um, why the the PS Mini is going to be a complete not waste of time. I think that's what I was kind of like watching at the time. And that's when I found out. I take it you're on some, um, looking at your response time tonight, I take it you're on some better internet tonight, Flame Tusk.
Yay, we did it. Oh, these are grandparents. Okay. He was cutting it pretty fine with that, um, with that battery man. Alright, so we got overhang here. And I assume that one's going to go there. That one's going to go across. And then the one in the middle is going to be rotated. So we're getting into a territory now where it's possible to, to lose pieces altogether. Very wary of that. Yeah, a bit like what we've just done here and there. Oh, jeez. Um. Should it? I'm starting to think though that that's not it's not the best place to be doing this. Oh, whatever well, reason it wasn't, because I'm a doofus. Um. Okay. So. In essence, I need to. that that doesn't work. I'll do that because that's just going to end up pushing that in the hole. I think I've resided myself too. Hmm.
is starting to get a bit tricky. It's only a medium. See, my problem is I can't see a way to... Maybe... I trapped myself. Then I've got no way to get the big one down again. No, I can't walk over the hills, Fain Tusk, no. Fortunately not. Obviously, depending on which way you, where you push the pipe will depend on whether or not it actually rotates in the air or not. So, if I push it at an end here, it won't rotate, but if I push it against there, obviously it's free to rotate. If I push it this side, it won't rotate. So, yeah. So, yeah, I think this would be, it would be too easy just to push this long one down. I think the long one's got to go... Thank you. 
Obviously, I can't now go back in the other direction. Uh, yeah, I, well, I, I've been meaning to do it for a while. I've just got like, um, I've got a better camera. When, when I say a better camera, I'm actually using my, my iPhone. Um, the camera on my iPhone. So, um, yeah, so obviously I got, just did a new overlay around the camera. And it, you can kind of like see more of this rather than being too close up to the face. Um, it's it's not, so, uh, not so close up. But uh, yeah, what's going on, buddy? Hope you're well. You missed out on some uh, Infinity, Infinity Factory stressing last night. <laughs> but, uh, we got there, we got there. Thanks to, um, much thanks to Iron Smeltery. Uh, Iron Smeltery. <sighs> You're Iron Smeltery. Much <laughs> thanks to Flame Tusk. I believe, no worries. No worries. I've actually been trying out some, um, back to the setup I've actually been trying out some um, green screen settings using my iPhone as well so I'm hoping that at some point in the future I will have a green screen setup you're gonna play destiny <laughs> I don't know what to do. Um, yeah, we've just got into like the area with the holes. Um, before this, we've just completed all the like pressure plate puzzles. And yeah, now we're on to puzzles with holes. Let's get this one go. Skulls Cross. I'll show you. I'll show you what they were. Uh, if I just go back to one. So basically, you have multiple pressure plates in these maps, and. Let me go back to a, a relatively simple one. So yeah, the pressure plates basically, um, they affect each one effect. The one you stand on affects the other one. So I stand on it. And then I can rotate it like that. So as you can see, like they kind of use each other. If that makes total sense, and it was like a very quick and brief uh, explanation. But then, like it gets more and more complex. And then this one, I got this one pretty quickly. But yeah, basically, I had to use the pressure plates to stack all the pipes on top of each other like that to uh, fill in the gap so that's pretty cool yeah I, I guess so yeah imagine a rotator on like a sensor I guess but that's going to fall in the hole and then I can't now use that. I think it's, it's the easiest thing. Thank you. 
so... So push that across there, and that does that. But we can work with that. I'm pretty sure we can work with that. So... Can't work with that, though. back a few steps. that then to push these bits into position But what I haven't noticed now... Uh, actually, I'm, no, I can do this. I can still do this. I think. So, I'm going to leave that one for the time being. Let's have a look at this one. Whereabouts are we? We're in that top corner there. I mean, we've still got quite a few here, though, that I've now skipped. <sighs> hmm. Fossil Lane. back there so I mean that would suggest to me I'd do something like this I can't push that any further than that that 
this is what's going to happen, isn't it? This one. But see, now I've done that, I've blocked that in, and that's just going to fall in there. I don't think I'm going to have any other to stand on now to move this other one, am I? Unless I do this. But I've got nowhere to rotate it out of the pit. That's in position. And then I need to rotate him the other way. But This one wasn't here. That wouldn't be too bad. Yeah, but here, here's the problem. I've this this one, this two bar at the top where I'm stood by right now is in the way. Because other than that, I just do that. But that doesn't want to be there. The one thing I should, probably should have mentioned before is not just enough to solve the puzzle, you actually have to get out as well. Down. If I do that, 
do that, I can't then move. That could be it though. to the left. Yeah, but... The problem is, I can't move it up, or else I can't then get behind it anymore. We're doing that now. That's too low. So to combat that, I would have to do something like Finish that sentence, don't worry.
God, this is a hard one. Now, looking at the name, I think... We're going to have to do... Something like this, where we're going to sacrifice the... So it's going to be I need strategic planning. You know what? Actually, I don't even need that one there. Because that's going to itself that How did I do this before?
I think my mistake here. I think I need one there. So that when I place this, walk through here, and then I can push that there. Alright, that's it. That's it. I got it. So, it is that one there. So, One, two, three. One, two, three. I mean, that would seem too easy. Plus, I can't do that.
has to screw everything. I was thinking, could I do that? Something like... suggesting maybe use the elbow piece to kind of like put them in the right sort of places I can I can see what you're getting at definitely see what you're getting at pieces on the two section yeah the problem with that is this though oh no that's it that's how I would do that Then put this one over there like that as well. Hold on. Come back to that a minute. That would make sense though because I've got... Also I've got all this extra room here. I think you're spot on. Okay. So now we have that. Uh, I can do... This. No, can't do that. goof though with that piece that I put on that on the two at the minute that one to push it down. Oh. 
Yeah, no, it's not that simple though because I need to move this one out of the way first. Because I need to get the elbow piece above the other piece. Yay! Teamwork! Team knock. Team knock. We done did it. And Smeltry are killing it. It's here, a great plumber. That's cool. I am too. In fact, I told her uncle a thing or two about plumbing. I doubt that. Alright, so let's put our knock brains together to try and work out this one then. Come on, we just solved hard ones, it's only a medium. We can do this, boys. My feeling is, I do this. <laughs> Let's knock our brains together. I need to rotate this piece. I think it's little, I think that one goes at the top. I 
turn gone idea. My idea is if I if I can drop this one in the hole here. I should do this like. Uh, oh, I should return them away. Going from the input corner facing left, then the L facing up, and then the corner piece as you have it. Okay, so that would require a rotation. So you're saying to have Hold on. Let's get let's let's get technical up up in here. Let's get technical. Let's get technical. This takes me back to like my days of the witness. This is what I used to do on the witness streams. You'll see in a minute, guys. It'll all become ever so ever so clear that we can do some kind of um Spitballing. All right, so let's bring this down. All right, so this is what I have. So this is what we have, right? This right here. So if I understand what you are saying, we're going to have this one here as that. We're going to have that one there like that. And then we need to rotate this one to be like that. Is that right? So the, the problem with that is that's going to take a lot of rotation to get this one Right. We have to bring it. Sorry, I'm not used to this new stipping tool. Are we not going to erase that ink? So what we're going to need to do is with this one. This one's gonna to have to like come down to like so that the bottom is level with here, so that this bit here can fit into this gap here, which will cause the rotation. So it's gonna to need to go here and here. So I push it once with an overhang of here and here. Push it again, and then it'll be flat there with the, this end pointing down. But then I'm going to have to... The issue with doing that is then I have no way of getting onto this side here. Unless I have a way All right, so the only other way to do it would be to this wasn't here. So ignore this one. So these are all, all blank tiles here, right? So if we can position that pipe So 
It's going to have to be there. But then again, how would I get behind, like onto the left hand side? Because what I was thinking there is I could just push it down, then rotate it from this side. You see, my original, my original thought process was, so like that there, then we have a small L or a T, a small L there, and the big one is going to go here like that. So that's one solution. Another option would be to have the big one there with one here and one here. I think it's too much to change the orientation of that big L shape personally. Can't get the corner at the top out, can I? Um, it's a good question. Let's just restart the puzzle. Let's restart the puzzle. Um, don't think so. The reason I say think So, with that in mind, then, go back to our sketching. That's got to sit there. So, then we have two options. We either do this and this. So, for that and that, the rotation, this is the only piece that we need to rotate. The other option would be to do this and this, which requires, does that require a rotation on both? I can't remember. Yes, that would require a rotation on both.
I need to push it. Oh. Um, I'm not just that completely screws it. Um, you look like this, there, and it's like, come on, it's a simple rotation. Like so obvious that that would now be top heavy. I may have it. I may have it.
even closer now. I feel like I'm even closer now, jeez. I have no options here. No, when I restart, no. <laughs> oh, whew. even if you reset, you can still go back. Whew, panic over, panic over, boys. trying to think if I could like block this one on the right temporarily That's what I want.
boys. Do you know what? I've freaking done it. I've only gone and freaking done it. <laughs> Holy smokes. And we've still got 14 to go. That's the stark realisation of this. Alright, so we've got a new fast travel point. This, I believe, is like that other puzzle we did. I we've got to put the pipes in the ground. That is the only thing I can do, do on this. Big question is though, where? <laughs> I was thinking about whether or not there was some sort of tomfoolery going on here. And by that I mean... doing something like that. But... no, we're not going to be able to connect it. So... I'm missing one valuable thing here. I can move this away from the edge.
attention to detail, people. Make a move. Jeez. move that any further. Screw that anyway. I was just seeing if I could like get like into like you can't see where my mouse is. Um I wanted to see whether or not I could get it into a oh, mouse and showing up. Um almost like like the second and third block up from the bottom is what I was seeing whether or not I could achieve but I don't think I can. I think sticking with what we got here. So here, what I want to do with this.
No! Thank goodness there's an undo button. Oh, you are shitting me. What I need is for the small L to be in an actual L shape, going from top left to bottom right, to like down and across. So then I could walk along here. Would that make a difference though? Actually, I think it needs to go from bottom left up across the top right. So I could stand here. Damn. If I do this, then I can't. I can't go like this, and I can't just this one.
Yeah, I did. I tried exactly the same thing there. I'm smeltering. I don't think I can though. That's the, that's the problem. I've noticed something about the design of the level on the other side of the gap. to work out this bit now. Thank you. 
And of course you can spring the rotation on me. Take that somehow. <sighs> that has to be like that. Boston Wafro with the raid of seven. Thank you very much. What's going on, guys? Welcome along to the stream. 
I am on the verge of um, I am on the verge of self destruction right now. <laughs> oh dear. What's a raid? A raid is where uh, another streamer um, comes along into your stream and they have finished streaming usually and they they bring their party to you uh, what's my accent my accent is um, uh, Lincolnshire mate mate Lincolnshire duck love chap <laughs> I don't know yeah it's uh, it's a Lincolnshire accent I am uh, a Lincolnshire yellow belly born and bred I am from the small coastal town of Boston not in the States What's going on, guys? How's how's the stream, Boston? What did you what was you streaming tonight? I, don't think I, I I saw the notification, but I didn't catch what you were streaming earlier on. I'd already started. So yeah, I am from the actual place that Boston pretends to be from. <laughs> You got a boss that's one of my kind. <laughs> oh, come on. Alright, so for everybody that's just joined us, um, thanks to Boston, just to kind of. He's playing Mega Man. Cool. I've played Mega Man for years, man. Salty, really? Uh, okay, so for anyone that's just joined us, this is Pipe Push Paradise, basically the idea is it's, it's a basically a block moving puzzle <laughs> it's really bad and we've basically got to connect up the water basically you'll see the water is running on the other side this is uh, level uh, 34 out of 47 and they're getting progressively harder was this a hard one yeah this is a hard one so basically what I'm trying to achieve is Excuse me, I've got to drop both of the pipes into the hole so that I can push over the long piece into position. Uh, now the issue, the issue I've got... Hold on. Yeah, the issue I've got is... I had it all, I, I thought I'd cracked it, uh, and I had like a setup from the bottom right going up, but it turns out I was like one short. I was one short. So it kind of just blew everything out of proportion, and now I'm just left crying in a corner because I can't see the solution. <laughs> oh dear. Use the long piece to push the elbow in. Yeah, but the problem with that iron smelter is I've got to... I've got to... Do what? what I've got to do. I've got to maneuver this around. Gotta maneuver this. Actually, that might work. That could work. So I'll push this up here. That gets that out of the way. Then I can do this. Uh, I need to get one more up. No! Don't do that. Right, so I do. This, this, and this. But if I do that... No, I was one block too short, Boston. I'm a one block too short. Go back a few steps. Okay. I do this, this, and this. Yay! 
Yes! Success! Suck freaking sess. Damn straight. <laughs> oh, man. Victory is mine. Um, what time are we at? We are at two and six. Oh, we're good. We're good for a little bit. That is the best victory sound. Now reset. No. No, 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 no. No resets. Okay, so we've got a choice of four to go for. Which one do we like the look of? Let's travel here using the pause menu. That one. What the hell? Jeez. It's basically every single pipe, apart from one elbow joint there, is going to be sacrificed. I've even got to get that elbow joint in there, man. Jeez. The only way to do that is going to be to do something like If I get everything lined up, on the assumption I don't need to use this area anymore, I get everything in place here and I push it that block straight across. That's on the assumption I don't need to bring anything else down here to put into position. Um, I kind of screwed the pooch though by pushing these two across here, because now I can't get to the right hand side. And I can't push them back, so that's unfortunate. All right, so that's that. Um, I, I don't want to tackle that one tonight. Let's be honest. Um, so then we have this one. the hardest one in the game I, I can't go to the hardest one in the game iron structure I've got to do one of these four in this area oh actually let's do easy ones easy one let's do this one yeah I'm, I'm up for this magnetic fields oh really really you're gonna throw that on me now Hey Eddie, what's going on buddy? I am... Um, I'm not going to be going for much longer, we're going for just over two hours. Um, and I'm really starting to feel the burn now. Yeah, e easy the game said. Easy! <laughs> Never believe the game. Well, there's nothing else I can do. Oh, that's true, I can do this. Then, then what? Then what do I do? Boston thinks he's got it. So we're dealing with magnetic pipes, right? So uh, I have just got these four here. I've done every single puzzle apart from these four here. I was just going for something. A little bit easier just to kind of give myself a little bit of a break but we're at 34 out of 47 so we've got uh, 13 more to go oh. 
what else? What else am I meant to do? Oh, you! Oh my goodness! So that's the thing. That's the thing. Jeez. Uh, is that the solution you anticipated there, Boston? <laughs> nope. All right, well. That's going to lead on to the magnetic area. I kind of think we should... I hope your uncle's okay. I miss him. Um... I kind of think I should probably tackle these ones. Um, all right, let's just let's go. Let's let's work around. Let's work our way around as we get to them. Clockwork. So this is a hard puzzle. Can I get all the way through? To, I can't get all the way through to the hardest one still. There's a. Um... Hokius, thank you very much for the follow, buddy. Appreciate it, guys. Make sure we give Hokius a big warm welcome to the Knot community. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, there's a big gate there that's stopping our progress, so we can't actually get to the last puzzle at this moment in time. I've not heard my pan pipes for a long, long time. Uh, well, rip. Twitch, what are you talking about? What are you talking about? <laughs> I'm some tree. Um, okay. We're pretty limited to our options here. He says. Famous last words. No, no worries. It's all good. Thank you very much for the follow anyway, Hokus. Appreciate it. It's all good. Alright, so... Something along the lines of <sighs> damn, but then Yep, that ain't gonna work. You don't know what the intended is? Does that mean you when you does that mean you've solved it in an unintended manner? Eddie. placed gap right there oh okay gotcha uh, okay so quite conscious though that I've got this area on the right hand side this big pit and probably put the first one over the gap then push it fully push it 
fully to place using the corner. Um, all right, starting position is this. That's that's what that's what we're starting with. Um, I've recently made a load of changes though on Smash. That's probably why you didn't get the big pan pipes. Right, so that should work. So hold on. Uh, we're saying there, I assume. Yeah, we've got to watch the rotation. So... Because now that's going to go the wrong way. I can prevent the rotation at all. If I go down, rip. Oh. At one point, you can push the corner to the bottom to turn it the proper way, then bring it back up. Alright, so let's go. Let's try it. Uh, homeless person asks you for money in a clever way. How was that, Eddie? Uh, people with crowns are, I believe, they're, they're Twitch Prime. Um... Pretending to be a time traveller. <laughs> Ask if it was 1997. Oh. Hold on. That's, that's pr pretty clever. That's pretty clever. Zovio, thank you very much for that. Um, thank you very much for those uh, tidbits there. Um, well, it is. Uh, no, I'll, I'll, I'll take another one. One more, one more. This is a. Ooh. One more as he walks into the next bit. No, walking straight out of that one. <laughs> expert. Are they all expert puzzles? Shit. Okay. So it would seem like we need the S-shaped pipe. Okay. Mm. 
And then we're going to want this one. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. I'm, I'm waiting for like the gotcha here because this seems this seems too straightforward at the minute. Where's the gotcha? There's the gotcha, the rotation. I knew it was there somewhere. Ah, uh, dear. Okay, so... Push that to there. I don't need that S shape there. I don't need that S shape piece there. Because, um, By the time, by the time the big S shape gets there, excuse me. By the time the big S shape gets there, I will have thought what I am going to say. Does that make sense? <laughs> so that needs to go there. There's only one gap there. So the fact that I've got a, a two wide block there means I'm only going to be just like push. Uh, there's always going to be a ledge here for that to sit on. Okay. So then, how tall is that? Three blocks. Possibly there. We can always come back. shape was rotated 90 degrees counterclockwise so that's going to be with this little pinky in the air like that. That, I think. Uh, 
Maybe another 90 degrees rotation. The S should be... You think I should have it rotated, oriented... Let me start again. You think I should have it oriented the other way? Like that. Okay, so if I had that oriented like that... But the problem is now... I would need to... Alright, let's try and see if I can do... Alright, let's move this down one. Turn the... Hey, Dr. Kecklon, what's going on, buddy? Welcome along to the stream. Hope you are well this fine, fine Tuesday evening. Okay, so then I can do this. So I need to rotate that block again. Man. This block. Rotate this block. It needs to go... So it's going to be... That. Shit. Sorry. I'm swearing. It's very naughty of me. No worries, Boston. You take care of yourself, buddy. Um, after everything you've had in the last week or so, I think uh, nobody's going to complain. You, you have a good night, buddy. I will hopefully catch you tomorrow over on your stream. I think I need to move the two bar as well. It's not in the right place. All right, let's just start again. Let's start again. Uh, actually, that was that. 
so that needs to Let's rotate like that. Move it up and then do it up here. Okay. Now I think what I'm gonna do this time just to try is take it over here and then do this no Not a big problem. Not a big problem. I can adjust then next got the same issue there. Oh dear. Yeah, I I was pretty sure that that wasn't in the right place there. But now I can't, I should have taken a freaking should have had more of a mental note as to what I actually did before. go back far enough to what I had before. Okay, this is what I had. This is what I had before. Can't rotate that there. Set up to reach the side of the Z closest to the pipe so you can rotate it. I don't help nobody. So Try and let me try and compute what you just said. Um, the side of the Z closest to the pipes, so you can rotate. Do you mean the pipes like these pipes here on the floor? Moving the corner one up one block. Okay. it runs out of undo moves you see just one move right before I want it 
Uh, okay, so. Uh, moving up one to there, right? seen a problem with this. Yeah, you see, I just need it to rotate there. So... get my snipping tool out this is where this is where we get technical this is where we get very very technical all right so this is where we get very technical guys uh we're done with that one we don't need to do that one so i think if i restart this okay and we take this one here and we place it here somehow that will allow me to walk over here, rotate it twice, and exit. So the question is, how do I get that into there? The only way to do that would be to use this one. So have it kind of like positioned. No, okay. So. To get that in position there, what I'm going to have to do is position this one first, like so. Then with this one, I can push it to here so that it stays like that. Then using this one, I can actually use the end to knock that one into position, which will give me that and that. I then flip this into the Z shape, because I have to do that in the S shape. Flip this into the Z, and then walk around there, flip it over here. All right, I think that's it. I think that might be it. All right, let's restart. So, first things first, this one goes in here. Nope, goes in there, as is. Nope, need to rotate it. Okay, then this one. there then we use this one Give it a little love tap. That's all I need to do. Okay. 
that's where I wanted the positioning. Boom! Boom shakalaka. Whew. Some people may laugh at me for using Snipping Tool, but um, if you guys have ever heard of a game called The Witness, um, Snipping Tool was my absolute saviour in that game. I'm working out so many of the puzzles. It's, um, yeah, The Witness, man. The Witness. I use Snipping Tool so much to try and work out different bits and pieces. Um, to try and visualise things, but... Um, Anyway, guys, that is going to bring us to the end of the stream. Thank you very much, everybody, for joining me. Thank you very much to Boston once again for the raid. I really appreciate everybody coming by and um, tuning in, giving me some support. Thank you very much, everybody, as well, for your um, inspirational words to see me through these puzzles. As always, links are on screen, guys. I will be back on Saturday night playing some more push pipe. We've got 10 more puzzles to go. Who knows? Maybe we can finish it up on Saturday. We will have to see. But until next time, I've been not, you've been awesome.